So it's a few different body sizes. <laughs> I'm going to let him hear it too since he's a police officer. So type. Whee! Whee! See? So what, what happened is I basically controlled his thumb. Okay. But this, this, this CSF already having a little tough time to hold his position, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like this. And this is literally only two, two fingers. So when you put down three extra finger, it give you a little more support. So as they try to, as your friends started trying to fight him, that will give you a little bit of time. Right? That so works. So this is basically, it's called s lock. Mm -hmm. See, S-shape. It's from, from this one. Mm -hmm. This is z lock. Okay. This way. Can you try stand, please? I'm going to go to the one, two, three. One, two, three. When you do this, just like his position, you couldn't be able to get up because of the way they are hand locked, right? <laughs> <laughs> now, <laughs> now the, the while ago I was talking about transfer from the regular homework to halfway point and free hand. There's a right before the halfway point, there's another technique that is actually from here. No more people thinking about this one. But when you're thinking about that one there, it could be nothing. So all you gotta do is come free hand. Right? Okay. When people grab you, their mindset is, I can get you. Mm -hmm. They thought they're the dominant one. That's why they grab you. If they thought that they could get beat up, they would never dare to grab you. Right. That's the, what, you know, so, uh, the psychologically understand how dominant was the mindset. Mm -hmm. So while they're not ready, I'm ready. Mm -hmm. When I'm ready, I'm going. Yeah. So I don't have to fight to get his head off. When I start locking the other side, he's gonna let go. Mm -hmm. That easy. Now, I could catch that hand in many different ways. What I did was this one. Right? You can also do this. Which is different is this one. Mm -hmm. When you're here, mm -hmm. or when you're here. We have all been changed with this. Oh, oh. Sure. Oh. How's that feel? <laughs> 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 I heard way out here. <laughs> <laughs> the femoral artery. When you yeah. give him a shot. Yeah. Yeah. It wasn't. Yeah. It wasn't. It wasn't the 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 It was the. It was the. Not femoral. Yeah. Down below. Okay. Yeah. That was a good shot. Okay. Don't remember that one for when the perk takes you down. <laughs> I've already used it many times. Right. Now, also, this this could be one here. You literally use this one. Go like this. But you do not do like. Use your foot. See? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Completely lock into your body. Catch. Oh. 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 So now you feel. Now you feel. Now you feel. Right? Oh, yeah. Yes. So. You okay? 
There are so many from the same principle, you can go different ways to use it. So today, for the next few minutes, I want you guys to practice this one. Watch this. Here. Uh, I'm sure that Master Kim already taught you, but since I'm here, I really want to spend a little more time with you guys. Right here. Uh, this one to punching the face. The first thing is realizing the direction of the punch. Mm -hmm. And able to get away. Punch. Mm -hmm. Now make it much forward right here. Look at this. This one. This. So you don't do this. You don't do this. That is knee and ankle breaker one on one. You have to do move your ankle like a dancing. Uh -huh. Two stancing, right? You have to, this, this, this got to be done all the time, no matter what. So, as you're learning from the, as a beginner for these steps, take your time. Never try to make fast movement. That's how you're going to miss little tiny detail, then you will be able to follow any time you Ready? Punch. So once you get away, you get a chance to control the person without even touch. So, <clears throat> next set is blocking with outside. Go. This one. Now. See? Never block this area, you need to block here. Look at my hand location. Yeah. Not like this. Yeah. Here. So let's say he pulled his hand back. My hand's still here. See that? So I'm not gonna just stay like this. When, when, when I see the movement, I just go with him. This one. So so whatever they move, just follow with him. Instead of trying to fight. I want to go this way, go with them that way. So instead of trying to pull them back to the other side. Okay. So that's first set is just the dodging. Second set is outside, this is called outside hand. Mm -hmm. okay. Next one is inside hand. Mm -hmm. Now with this side hand, you can see the application can be a little different. Okay. Now I didn't even grab him. I wrap his arm. Now this can be done, bam, right? Like this way. Of course from here, because you're the, the other one who stand in the timing position, so you can always drop your knee on the neck to reverse. Mm -hmm. We can go here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and for Hank, when on his back. So you can just control wherever you want to control, instead of actually, you know, followed by their movement. Okay, so let's stand up. Okay. Stare up, guys, stare up. I'll let you put it in. I'll dodge. Okay, so this is basically what we're doing. Let me go with you. Oh, and that jumps into it. Okay. Four, <laughs> four, 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 four,
gentlemen unable to lock my hand, not because I'm a strong guy. I'm only Oh no those were strong. <laughs> <laughs> I can build over the earth. <laughs> I'm only 175. Okay, so I'm not that heavy guy. But I always made my coinage. And another thing, controlling the weakest area. Mm -hmm. That's two things combined at the same time. That's why even guys are bigger. It doesn't matter. I used to teach you guys like 375 pound guy, big monster guy. It didn't matter. End up same thing. So tight. So oh. more. Oh. <laughs> That's, That's about the leg guy. Yes, sir. Keep it, keep it. I want you to keep it. Okay. Keep it. Come on, keep, keep it. Come on. What are you doing? Keep it. <laughs> so how you feel? A little exposed, sir. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Right? <laughs> so when you have this one, that's you got the finger. Ah! <laughs> that's it? Right. So you're gonna have a total control whatsoever, whatever it is. Ah! Stay <laughs> <laughs> <Big> here. <laughs> right? Okay. And then what if the guys grab it both hands? Tight. Right. Same thing. Trust me, it's the same thing. Why? If I go logically, my one single arm against the both arm. He's going to beat me every time. Right. I have to use this, which is look at the size of my leg versus his arm. I will beat him every time. That's what it is. Okay. I didn't touch you with this one. Just this only. Right? Like that. Mm. As he's holding you so tight to keep my in the oh. <laughs> yeah. oh. right. The wrist, wrist control is even more simple if you work with the steps. Specifically, watch my steps only. I'm going to control this one. So, okay. so, so you'll be so surprised. Mm -hmm. Only this one. Okay? Ah! Okay. Oh. So you don't need to fight. That burns. <laughs> <laughs> Grandmaster Kim is one phenomenal band. And he, he was so fluid and his technique was so perfect that it, it, it was hard to even fathom that that could happen like that. that he was so e he had such an easy technique that so quickly disabled the opponent. And believe me, there were times where I tried to disable him and it didn't work at all. He's a very strong guy and uh, very knowledgeable and uh, communicates very well. And, and I really appreciate his time with us today. He was a fantastic teacher, and I, I would welcome an opportunity to train with him again. <laughs> That was just an amazing class to see Master Kim take somebody down with such minimal movement was uh, something to strive for. And uh, looking forward to one day being able to do a quarter of what he was talking about. 